Good morning, everyone. How's everybody doing? So let's start class off with Nuno today. Nuno, what do you think about the case? Nuno, you don't have to raise your hand during cold call. OK, uh, let's move on to somebody else. Uh, Brooke, what do you think? Uh, never mind. Uh, Lee, what should the protagonist do? <coughs> Sorry, Professor. It was a really rough night last night. Uh, fair enough. Chris, what should we do? Uh, you caught me at a really bad time. Well, we're not getting off to such a good start today. Um, Aaron. Why don't you get us going? I'd like to push back on that. But we haven't even started yet. I totally disagree. Okay, well, uh, James, uh, I seriously hope you can get us off the ground. Still striking out. All right. Mr. Park. Did you read the case last night? Yeah, well, I guess, I mean, since the MPV is negative, I'd definitely sell in this situation. But, John, this is a uh, marketing class. We don't really care about the company's finances. Well, I guess in that case, then, I'd just check out the free cash flows and decide what to do from those. Uh, great. Uh, Scott, do you have any Canadian support for us today? Let's take this outside. Wow, e easy, Scott. This is a friendly learning environment here at HBS. Uh, Luca, what, what would you do? Ah, okay. Uh, in Italy, uh, we pass all the time. It's, it's our favorite food. Uh, I believe you, Luca, but this case didn't have anything to do with pasta. Um, Carrie B., uh, would you like to add something? Yeah, if we step back and look at the big picture here, I think it's obvious that we're missing uh, the fact that there's no pasta in this case. Good catch, Kerry. Um, Jordan, you have any insight to add here? Yeah, so I think this is a classic case of the philosophical struggle between uh, metaphysical principles. Okay, I have no idea what you just said, but um, Brandon, you, you want to add something? Yeah, I think uh, if we were to have a party and if we had free bottle service, we could expand our market share by uh, increasing our customer awareness. I mean, everybody loves popping bottles with the prints. Okay. We'll come back to you later. Doug, you want to respond to Brandon's comment? Yeah, I, I agree with what Brandon said. But I want to push back on popping bottles. I just don't think that strategy is going to work at all. But isn't that what Brandon wanted? Uh, you know what, that's fine. Guy, are you okay? All right, can anyone in Section E give me a real answer for what we should do? Yes, Jeff. Yeah, I think we should use the four P's, the six M's, the other four P's to better understand the marketplace. That way, when we go to market with a campaign as described in the case, we'll have first mover advantage. And if anybody else tries to come in behind us, we'll be safe and sound. Thanks, Jeff. That's perfect. All right, everybody. Well, thanks for a great semester. Have a good break.